Well, as the temperatures soar, San Diegans are trying to get their pools summertime ready, but with a nationwide chlorine shortage, well, many pool companies are just finding it hard to keep up with the demand. Fox 5's Misha DeBono is in Encinitas with what pool owners can do to save some money and, of course, get through it. Once the word gets out that liquid chlorine is in, there's like a rush. So and it goes quick. A nationwide chlorine shortage is forcing pool maintenance companies to resort to black market type tactics to get product. Within two hours, they get 200 to 400 cases of chlorine in and they're gone. So what we've been doing is buying dry chlorine which I really don't prefer. Kurt Vitrano is the owner of Kurt's Pools out of Poway. He's been in business for 39 years and said he's never seen anything like this. There's some reports of a fire at a manufacturing plant that's to blame, but Vitrano says his suppliers say it's residual effects of the pandemic and the labor issues that many industries are facing. Like other pool companies, he switched to the less favorable dry chlorine to get by. It's definitely more expensive for dry chlorine than it is liquid, so we have bought drums and drums and drums of the dry for now to get us through the shortage and so we stocked up in that. He's also advising his clients to boost the circulation of their pumps so they run longer and turn down the temperature or turn off solar but there's no way around chlorine. When you get down below a certain part per million 1.0 you get what's called combined chlorine that's when chlorine mixes with ammonias and then creates what's called chloramines. That's what causes ear infections and health problems in a pool. So the chlorine is the most important part of a pool. And so according to uh, Vitrano Supply People, they took a pretty big hit during COVID, having to lay off more than half of their staff. And they say, like a lot of industries, they're just having real trouble hiring people back. But they do expect that to change in about a month. From Encinitas, Misha DeBono, Fox 5 News. It's going to take a little time. All right, Misha, thank you so much.